Good morning, everybody. So I've had some special requests to explain what does base mean when it comes to volume. So I'm gonna do this real quick video so that you can understand what the base means in a 3D object. So let's take a look. Volume equals length times width times height. But sometimes you're going to see volume equals capital B times height. Well, that capital B actually is the combined um, length times width, or what we know is area. So on this one right here, I drew it out, and I want you to see length times width, and then there's the times height. But the base is, oops, sorry, doing this upside down is not the easiest. That is the base piece. So it is like the first layer. That is what we call the base. So when you get volume equals base times height, you need to find out the base. Here we can see that the length is two and the width is one, two, three, four. So base equals length times width. For this one, base equals two times four. So base equals eight. So then you can plug in your volume equals base times height. So volume equals base times height. Volume equals, now we know what base is, eight times, and we just have to count the height, one, two, three. Height is also known as layers. So that's very important. You may see height equals layers. Okay, so there you have it. That will help some of you in the worksheets that we did yesterday when it asks for the area of the base, the number of layers, and what the total volume is. Thank you for listening and tuning in. As always, if you have a comment or a suggestion, please make sure that you drop a comment below.